Hello everyone, it's Patty Gurdy. Today we are reacting to a few of my music videos. But first of all, I wanted to tell you a little update about my music. Your girl has been busy. I am producing a new CD at the moment and it's going to be released this year, so I have to hurry up. You'll get more information about the new music on my social media and I strongly encourage you to look up Patty Gurdy on Instagram and to give me a little follow and say hi somewhere in the comments. Also, I am on Facebook and I'd really love to see more of you guys over there because we have a lot of people here on YouTube, but I post much more often on Instagram and Facebook. So to distract myself of all the home studio recording I've been doing, we're going to look through some videos now. I thought I could tell you a bit about some behind the scenes information or just some funny facts that maybe happened during filming. However, what should we start with? Okay, let's start with the longing. Okay, I will stop right here. This is a beautiful shot. Parts of this video, the longing, have been shot in Scotland and another part I shot in Germany. For those of you that don't know, I used to study in Scotland and I was there for a couple of months. Uh, I studied communication design. So when I was in Scotland, I met some very nice other folk musicians and we had a lot of sessions in pubs and uh, in other like open mics and so on. At the first open mic night that I went to, a producer came to me and said, that was like the classic, classic situation, a producer came to me and said, hey, you have a very interesting instrument. I'd love to record this because I don't think I'll ever get another chance to record the hurdy-gurdy again. So, uh, of course I said yes. And I also said, you know, actually, because I, I just uh, put out Gertie screen, as far as I know. Um, and I said, you know, I'm doing this thing with my Gertie where I layer the instrument. The producer Nassif actually had so much patience to do this. And I think it turned out really, really nice. Uh, but I, I, I can't even tell you how many evenings we spent recording this song because it has so many layers. Uh, pfft, at least like six recording sessions. And after university I kept, I kept walking <laughs> with my hair Gurdy into town to his studio. And then in the middle of the night I kept walking back and like each walk was like... I don't know, half an hour or one hour through the cold. I also remember on the way back once in the middle of the night, it was very cold and uh, one of my strings actually broke. Yeah, so these parts... Whoa. So these parts I shot in Germany and back then I had no budget to shoot. I just had my camera and I was really struggling with setting it up because it was not the best camera for filming yourself. It was so hard to get myself into focus. And the ring light I actually used on this shot. I made it myself. I, I used a very big stainless steel bowl, I think. And then I had like an LED strip and I stripped it inside of the bowl or like on the outside, like, you know? And then uh, it had, I think it was it had a little battery and I could turn it on and I had to tape it on on some kind of other stick and put it in front of me in order to get light. So if, if that's not a low budget production, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, we're, we're getting close to 10 million clicks and I filmed with a self-built ring light <laughs> and my mom wanted the bowl back. But now I also have a lot of people that support me financially on 
Patreon! Hey, if you want to support me financially, then you can do so on Patreon. Never mind, let's go back to the video. Oh yeah, by the way, this shot is also shot in Germany. My little sister shot those shots when she was 14. Low budget production. Thanks, sister. <laughs> Let's have a little look into the comments. Okay. Petty Gerdy is the high level bar that every adventuring party can find space for. Aww. Aww, this is so cute. Just the hurdy gurdy, yeah, I can listen to this. Just the woman's voice, yeah, I can listen to this. But both put together, no, put both together, I no longer fear death, for I have already heard heaven. Oh! Okay, I have to start with one thing. This day was the hottest day of the year. And if there's one thing that I hate, then it is hot days. I cannot stand hot days. I felt terrible. But you can't see it in the video and I'm I'm always wondering how how can this look so good without I mean I was dying. <laughs> And this it was shot in a, a very tiny, like, shed, garden shed of my mother. <laughs> because, once again, I did not have any budget to, you know, for, for a filming location. So this now has over 4 million clicks and uh, we can take a look in the comments as well you made me enter in a whole new universe from the metal worm nice i actually i actually do have a lot of metal people coming over to hear my music for some reason my music is uh i mean i wouldn't say it's metalhead approved but a lot of metalheads do still listen to my music i i recently recorded for Ailstorm, the pirate metal band, and also Arion, this super crazy prog metal thing from Arjen Lukasen from the Netherlands. Totally love it. And also for Skardust, my friends from Israel. Let's do one more video because I don't have a lot of time right now because I still have to record some songs for my next CD. Maybe Luring. Okay, because the question comes up every time. Yes, it was cold. It was actually so cold. I only dared to stay in for uh, about two minutes at a time and then I had to get out. And I think we repeated this for four times. Um, and I was so happy that we filmed in, filmed in slow motion because when you film in slow motion, you actually speed up the audio. So what is four minutes 44 seconds here is then two minutes 22 so you only have to stay in the water for half the time for example there were so many bottles in the river like broken bottles of people that just throw it into the river i really had to take care not to put my hand into you know shards of glass uh, it was super disgusting <laughs> Oh my god, yes! Look at his nail polish! Or nail varnish! And all the tattoos! I love those tattoos! And the rings! And the instruments! I just love this picture! <laughs> it's so pretty! So many beautiful things! Oh yeah! There's actually a little butterfly in the background. I don't know if anyone ever noticed, but there's a butterfly. <sighs> not sure 
if I ever said that, I might have said it before, sorry. But um, this song was originally also written for Carnival Row. This was one of three songs I wrote for a scene that didn't even make it in the final cut. Um, but after, after I heard that they don't want to use it, I almost immediately rewrote it so I could put it on my album. And then later, in the studio, working with my uh, producer, Bernd Wendland, in Berlin, he said, you know what, let's, let's invite someone. Let's invite Fawn. I was like, Fawn? I mean, okay. Ah! <laughs> Love that band. One of my favorite bands, for sure. How beautiful is Oliver's voice? <sighs> the voices in the background are actually Laura Feller and Fiona Frivert, the two singers of Fawn. Actually, Fiona just left the band. Very sad. She also played the the whistle or the flute on another song, The Quarry Man, from that same album, Pest and Power. Let's scroll down to a few comments. Honestly, never thought I'd see Oliver sing in English. I was so used to hear him sing German. That was not the first time he sang English. It's You have to look back on all the, the older fun albums, they have so many songs in so many different languages and they have sung in English before. So one song that comes to my mind, for example, is Adam Leggy Bounden. But I'm sure there's other songs as well. They sing in so many languages. That's it from Patty Gurdy today. I will record a lot of vocals and hurdy gurdies in the next few weeks. Also, I'll record some videos for you, of course. And I'm doing everything at high speed because I really want to release this CD this year. So, I'm back to work. And as I said, follow me on Instagram and on Facebook. And if you liked it or you have some more ideas for little videos, then you can write a little comment. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you soon again with some new music. Bye-bye! <laughs>